uh, past 10 years, if I'm looking for the Finnish Spain Association, which is um, the original name is Suomen Kipu, and nobody knows what it means. But anyway, so Finnish Spain Association. Um, we managed to open conversation with the healthcare professionals and in the beginning nobody knows what the SIP means but we keep on telling that in Finland and finally ma we managed to open the negotiations and now we have opened our own SIP platform. So awareness I would say is the major achievement. I hope better. Um, I'm quite sure that when we when we open real cooperation with the patient and with the healthcare professionals, we have, for example, in law in Finland, we have two laws. The first one says that the um, patient and doctors work together and they make the uh, like they. Uh, say what kind of treatment you have, what kind of medicine you you will get and, and rehabilitation and whatever. And the second law says that it is the doctor who make those rules. And when you have those like two phases, kind of two phase um, regulations and two phase legislation, it needs to be disappear. It needs to change like a fair and square fair and square play and then then the the healthcare for in, at the chronic pain will change a lot and then it starts to actually become as a negotiation with the professionals and with the patients and not just the not just the pain doctors but like multidisciplinary uh, discussions and i'm quite sure it will change a dramatic way If I'm talking personal stigma, I'm, I would say I'm a wrong, wrong person to answer because I'm always treated as the same person as I have been. But when I look uh, stigma at the workforce and stigma at school and, and among like other workers, um, I'm, I'm teaching at the vocational school as like a paid job. And, uh, when you have talked with the other teachers, they don't speak to each other what are they pain or what are they situation because they are fear what, what the other person is going to say. And now the discussion is open and finally when you sit on the table and somebody says that um, I have pain, I have had chronic pain 10 years and the other one asks, really, I have two and then they have been working together like five years and they don't even know that the other one has a headache and the other one has a back pain and still they try to work everyday life on the same way even they could help and they have started to help each other so um, stigma you have to open your mouth and make make the pain visibility or visible <laughs>